discharge cargo, trimming ship for effective operation. Ship's condition, such as trim, heel and draft, must be maintained in the allowable range of the terminal. Ship's trim and list affect the progress of discharging cargo work. Ensure the required trim and list values for efficient cargo operation. However, it is recommended that an adequate level of trim and list be made so as not to damage the facility or the ship. As the vessel always loads cargo at the maximum allowable limit of the berth or port, it is recommended to discharge uniformly at the beginning of discharging work so as not to cause the ship's bottom plate to touch the seabed. If the ship is trimmed to an appreciable extent when the tanks are full, and if the water tightness of hatches, butterworth openings and ullage openings of tanks to be discharged are in unsatisfactory condition due to poor maintenance, there is a risk of gas spewing out or oil leakage due to localized pressure. Safety measures should be adopted considering the maximum aft trim as about 6 meters when the tanks are fully loaded. During the initial stage of discharging, a large aft trim may not be required, but a trim of more than 4 meters is required during stripping the tank, and where possible, 6 meters of trim should be ensured with reminder that other tanks may be fully loaded. Trim adjustments should be made while monitoring and ensuring hull strength by entering the latest data in the computer and carrying out ballasting work in parallel. In most cases, the planned trim should be obtained by ballasting. The ship may be listed using ballast, so that the optimum stripping is obtained after studying the location of the stripping bell mouths in the tank. But the heel may also be adjusted using cargo, depending on the operation.